Hey, here's another interesting VS Code tip. Uh, what happens is that, you know, when I'm working in an office or at home, I have, you know, big external screens. And you have plenty of screen real estate space. And that's the number one thing I miss when I'm, you know, working on the road, uh, portable. Because then I'm on a 15-inch or a 13-inch screen. And then every little bit of screen real estate matters. Now, fortunately, VS Code has thought of that. Here is what we do. So let me just go ahead and open this project here in VS Code. Uh, doesn't matter what kind of project it is. Uh, I just created this using Angular CLI. It's the starter project, but it doesn't really matter. So a couple of interesting things you can do is you can hit F11, and that makes it full screen. So this is this is very good. And you know, F11 to toggle again, it gives you a little bit more screen, screen real estate space. So that's good. Uh, another really cool thing you can do is that you know you can set up shortcuts for this you can say toggle zen mode and then basically your file is all you are focusing on double escape to escape out of that and here is a setting that i'm you know puzzled why this is not just the default which is toggle menu bar so the menu bar is still there and as that message tells you if i alt i can reveal that menu bar again similarly one other thing you can do is that for those of us who have who are coming from the Visual Studio, we're used to seeing this tree on the right-hand side. So what you can do is that you can say move sidebar to the right and, you know, it moves to the right. Personally, I've gotten quite used to, you know, seeing it on left, so I'll keep it on the left, but, you know, personal preference, but that's another thing you can do. So those are a couple of, you know, screen real estate tips, and you, could, you should uh, probably... Uh, you know, visit this view menu because there are a bunch of other interesting things here that you might like.